Hi there everyone, this is Angel Princess 2431 and welcome to the first day of this Mari Party extravaganza hype. <laughs> well, maybe not day one, that's for Mari Party, the first one. This is day advance for Mario Party Advance. And the reason why my voice is in a different tone is because I'm playing late at night. Specifically during the daylight savings hour. Yeah, don't tell me to go to bed because by that time, by the time this is uploaded, it's already too late to tell me that. <laughs> so here, we'll start off with more pretty events with my three favorite mini games and two disliked mini games. So I actually had a tough time deciding which three would be my favorite and which two are my disliked. But I have decided on which one. So firstly, how about we just go with one that's actually predictable. Florid. I made a separate video- I had made another video in the past where I played a mini- my favorite mini game of each Mario Party. And for Mario Party events, it was Florid. This one. So yes, for the rest of the Mario Parties in the future days, you, you will be able to know, or predict, which mini game will be one of the top threes. So if you've seen that 200, it's a, it was a 200 sub special of mine. So if you've seen that one, you already know at least one mini game that I will pick. <laughs> Except for Island Tour, because I, I when I made that video, my top favorite mini games of each Mar party, Island Tour was not included. So the way Mario Party advances, all it doesn't have any four-player modes or four-player mini games. All it just has is um single mini games, which work like high scores. So all the single mini games here are like oh, like try to get a high score. What's the highest score you can get, or um, what's the fastest time you can get? And usually the fastest time are really quick mini games, like they don't last very long, and. For mini games like trying to get a high score like this one, uh, they could take a while. They can really take a while. Like, see that high score of mine, nine nine nine. Yeah, I made another video where I, <laughs> where I actually got all, um, when I made that high score. Oh my gosh, that took like a while. That took like eleven to twelve hours in a span of three days. <laughs> I am not gonna do that again. Was it fun? Uh, just in the beginning, but then afterwards it was like, ah, uh, this is getting tiring, can I like, go to bed, can I stop, rest? <laughs> uh, so yeah, I'm just gonna quit here because I will probably not lose here, and if I do it will be too long. <laughs> so let's move to my next favorite mini game. So see, 9999 nearly 1 million points! <laughs> I will always be very proud of this high score. So the next mini game that I like, Sort Stack. Where we're gonna be sorting books into its right shelf color. You'll see. <laughs> Peach is like, oh, oh no, who made this mess? <laughs> Such a very disorganized person. <laughs> so yeah, the objective here is to organize all the books, like how I said. Oops, I messed up. That was a huge fail. <laughs> so you can only hold two books at a time. If you try to- if you want to get another book, you have to place into another shelf. Oops. Oh yeah, I, I did make- I'd explain why Flora was my favorite. Um, I don't know. I just really liked how you're supposed to take everyone to their floors. So it's like somehow I found amusement with that. And here in Sword Stack, you know what? It might be a little bit similar to Flora. You're just trying to get everything organized, trying to place where they're supposed to go. <laughs> So you know, Florida, you're supposed to take the passengers to the right floors, and here in 
sorts like you're organizing the books to where they're supposed to go. So maybe I just like organized mini games. I don't know. <laughs> I, I, I could see that. It's like a little theme I have. I like to organize stuff. I mean, do I like to keep my stuff organized in my room? Yes, of course I do. But do I actually do that? Most of the time, no. My room can be quite messy at times. But I mean, it's my own room. I know where my stuff are. It doesn't matter. As long as I know where my stuff are. And it's not like I get much visitors here anyway, so it's like, eh, whatever. But is it fun to organize stuff? Yes, I do have fun organizing stuff. So I guess that's why I enjoy this minigame, and the fort. <laughs> Except the only difference between this and fort, this actually gets harder much, much later. That's why my high score here is not 9999, because <laughs> eventually um, the books, the bookshelves will um, start to uh, get bigger, like all uh, can't concentrate. <laughs> okay, see how the bookshelves they are right now? It's like that, like, you know, separate. And then, oh, okay, here's a good example. Like, later on, a lot of books are just like these, where everything it has books, there's no free space for you, and I messed up, but oh, well. <laughs> and, yeah, it's like, oh, where am I supposed to go, you know? You eventually just run out of time. So it's like, okay, this is why I do not have 9999 on this one, because I eventually run out of time. And you get time by completing a stack of books, or a row, row, row of books. Except for the last one, so you should make that last one um, usually the smaller shelves. Because the smaller the shelf, the less um, time you get to... Well, the less time you have to for sorting the books out. If that makes sense. I'm sorry, I can't really, I can't exactly concentrate when I make commentary, but I also don't want to be quiet throughout this video either. Uh, okay. That's good, the red one's the last one, which is exactly how I want it. And oh, don't take that book out! Yeah, I would get three plus seconds, but I didn't get Three plus seconds there. Uh, wait, where's the yellow? Okay. Oh wow, I can concentrate a whole lot better when I'm not talking. When I'm not talking. <laughs> but I don't want to be silent either. I think I might end up. <laughs> I think I might end up trying to beat this record, maybe. No, I'm gonna lose eventually. Should I keep playing this until I lose? Or just quit now? I honestly do not think I'm gonna beat my record. No, I am not gonna beat my record. Where does the red book go? Oh, I'm okay, I'm gonna lose anyway, so... Ah, uh, get the green book! No, come on, Peach, get the book! Buy myself some more time. Oh no, Peach! Stop it! No! No! Roar! Get the book! Get the oh, I lost. Oh, I should have. Why did I go to the red shelf? Whoops. Oh well. It's actually a good time to stop playing this mini game. Playing one mini game for five minutes? <sighs> Dang. No Mar parties like that, really. Only advanced, because you're trying to make a high score. So anyways, that was my second favorite minigame, sword stack. Much like Florida, where it's like, organizing stuff, yay! <laughs> so my third favorite minigame, Mario Party Vance is, where is it? Here it is! Slammer! Which is a dual minigame! Now this one, oh, there's no computer difficulty. But, if you can somehow get yourself another Game Boy Advance, or at least a Game Boy Advance Cable multiplayer. It's pretty fun with friends. It's pretty much whoever has the quicker reaction. So when your character's face pops up, you push A to attack your opponent. But if your opponent's face pops up, you gotta defend yourself. 
So, so far I've been attacking Mario because it's been showing my face. <laughs> oh, there it is. So I defend and they hit themselves. <laughs> it, it really is whoever has the quicker reaction because even if your opponent's face shows up and you do nothing, uh, you're still gonna get hit if your opponent defends. But if neither of you do anything, I guess nothing will happen. Look, victory screen! And Marpre Events does not have any voices, by the way. Only three characters have voices, and it's not even like voice voice, it's just their little sounds. So like Boo, Womp, and Chin Chomp. You know, like, Roof Roof, Chin Chomp, Roof Roof, Womp. And boo, uh, <laughs> something like that. <laughs> uh, okay. So those were my, so that's my third favorite. Now, for my s two dislike mini games. Yeah, the ones that I don't like or the ones that I hate playing. Ah, for this one, I had I had choice between three, and I know after playing a bit, I figured out which ones, which two I dislike the most. The first one is Go Go Pogo. This one, it's not so much the minigame itself, it's the stupid controls. So to make that jump, I have to jump higher. Right there, right? But sometimes the jump button will not cooperate with me. So I end up mistiming the jump. And I, and if you don't, if you don't jump high, you will not make that first jump. And then later on, there's gonna be like another jump where you have to time it. Oh my gosh! <sighs> Pretty much, if the button, if the control worked better on this mini game, it would not be my disliked mini game. Like simple controls, just hop on a stick, go for the goal, pull the stick, go to go, and yeah, only controls is jump higher and move. But I don't know why the timing of this stupid jump is. Can be difficult. Oh my gosh! Like pretty much to have a really good record on this is to jump the whole way. Oh my gosh! Really? Ah! Uh, when I want to jump higher, I, it just doesn't happen. Ah! Uh, this is why I don't like this mini game. Even on my Game Boy Advance, actually, it started on my Game Boy Advance. That's when it's like uh, I can't get the timing right. Ah! Uh, oh! What the? Okay, that was a glitch. That first piranha plant should have hit me, but it didn't. Okay. So pretty much to get that record, you have to be jumping high the whole way to go, you know, cover more ground. I don't know how I did it. I was just super lucky at that time. Ah, I just don't like this control. That's why I, I hate this mini game. Go go pogo. My second disliked one. Oh, I just passed it. It's Koopa Curl. Oh my gosh, when I first played this dual mini game, it's like, ah, what the heck, it's like complete sabotage, ah, it's pretty much that ice curling game, sports game, whoever has the most points at the end wins. We have three shells and it's on two rounds, so after we use up these three shells, there's another round of three shells. This is the only dual minigame out of eight of them where, oh my gosh, I cannot win. It's like, how the heck do you even play this? It's like, you want to sabotage your opponent, but somehow they sabotage you more. Ugh. You know what, let's just sabotage Mario, get him out of there. Or sometimes when you're trying to sabotage, you end up sabot- When you try to sabotage your opponent, you end up sabotaging yourself. Or like this in Mario's case, he could just completely- Ah, uh, he went last so he could do whatever the heck he wanted. I just- uh, I really dislike this minigame. And I guess in that matter, I really don't like this kind of curl game. Even though this is the only curl game variation I've ever played. But it's one of the dull mini games I do not want to play when I'm in when I'm playing Mario Advance. 
Oh, you're so mean, Mario. Dang it. Well, I still have two more shells, I guess. I could still sabotage him at the end. Oops, I messed that aiming up. Oh, no. Oh, my gosh. That's going to cost me. I just know it. Times two, huh? You know what? That times two will be for nothing if you don't have any points in the first place. So I'm just gonna throw this, get rid of those shells, and he's- oh wow, we're tied. That's a first. <laughs> Everybody loses. When there's a draw in advance, everybody loses. <laughs> uh, so yeah, Koopa Curl and Pogo Go Go are my two dislike mini games of Mario Kart fans. I really don't like them. <sighs> okay, another runner-up of a dislike mini game was this one, Trap Floor, mainly because this is one of the six Bowser mini games where I lose frequently. Oh my gosh. Aha! If I said two dislike minigames, I'm not gonna play this one. And there was another minigame that I had liked, but chose not to. Oh yeah, plus this was another good runner-up, and Spooky Spike? Uh, no, not really. Not really. The three, the, the three minigames I liked here, yeah, I really liked them here. <laughs> okay, so this was Day Advance of the Mario Party Extravaganza hype. Or Mario Party hype extra yeah, extravaganza. <laughs> uh, hopefully maybe next video I will not be recording this late at night. So yeah, I'm gonna go to sleep now. <laughs> this is Angel Princess 2431. See you in day DS.